guys and welcome back. Um, I went to Walmart yesterday and picked up a few things that I wanted to show you guys. Um, I was just going to pull it out of the bag and show you what I bought, but I figured that I would go ahead and take it out and test it. That way I could let you guys know if it was good or not and what I thought. So we're going to go ahead and get started. Um, the first thing that I picked up at Walmart are these tweezers right here. Um, I have a favorite pair of tweezers. I can't find them anywhere, so I figured that I would pick up this pair right here. Um, I've tried several different brands of tweezers, and they either pull my skin or poke me. And um, So these are, have like more of a blunt tip. These are by e.l.f. They were only a dollar, so I figured if they don't work, then I'm not really missing out on a lot. Um, I'm really hoping they look like they're going to be really, really good, and they might just be my new favorite. So I'll let you guys know if I really like these. And if I do, I'll probably go pick up a few more pair just so I have one in every room in my house. <laughs> The next thing I want to talk about is this e.l.f. Brow Pencil. Um, it is in the shade Dark Brown. Um, it has a spoolie on one end, which I really like, and then it has the pencil on the other end. You get a fair amount of product um, for it to be a brow pencil. Um, so I'm really excited about this. I did try it today. My brows are dark anyways. I'm still trying to learn the art of shaping and sculpting my eyebrows. Um, I have always done my own eyebrows. I have went to the salon to get them done maybe one time. So that is why I buy the tweezers and I buy this. Hopefully this is really, really good. I attempted it today. I don't know about it yet. I'm going to use it a few more times and let you guys know what I think. The next thing that I bought, um, the next two things I bought kind of go, um, they kind of coincide, go hand in hand. I bought these um, Salon Kiss True Volume Lashes in Ritzy and I got this Duo Eyelash Adhesive in Dark Tone. I am wearing these eyelashes lashes today. They are very, very pretty, very um, voluminous. They are very, very long. As you can tell, if I look up, you can see them for sure. I really like them. They're really light. Are you going to talk the whole time? They're really, really light and they stay on. I mean, and they feel really good. So you don't feel like you have something taped to your eyeball. So I'm going to wear these. I'm going to, hey, hey. So I'm going to wear these all day and see what I think and I'll let you guys know. The next thing that I got that I'm really excited about is this Color Workshop Highlight and Blush Palette. I was really excited. It was only $4.88 at Walmart. You get three highlighters and three blushes. Um, honestly, of the highlighters, this one is the only one that I see myself using. And of the blushes, this is the only one I see myself using. I'm not Barbie and I don't want my cheeks to be that color. These two highlights right here are more of a golden. If you are really, really tan, but... I'm a white girl. So I'm going to swatch these for you. We're going to see which one. The swatches are absolutely gorgeous. See? They're very, very pretty. This is the one that I really like, and these are the two um, gold ones. So I would swatch them on my hand. The only bad thing that I have to say about these, that is them right there. There, it's the one I really like. You can't really see. The um, color payoff is okay. For $4.88, you know, it's a pretty decent palette. Um, these blushes are really pigmented. The only thing I will say about these blushes is they are pretty chalky. Um, those are the colors. This is the only one that I can see myself using because these two are just a little too much for me. Um, these colors are really, really pretty. And again, for $4.88, you can't really beat that. The last thing that I bought at Walmart is this Maybelline Master Chrome metallic highlighter. Um, I've heard people rave about this. I got it in molten gold. I, for some reason, wasn't thinking when I bought this and I thought that my skin tone would look good with this. I am wearing it today. It does not look horrible. I actually kind of like it. it. It is so blinding. I'm going to show you guys a swatch real fast. Do like that. Look at that. So blinding. So pretty. That is, oh god, that's horrible to see. Very, very pretty. It looks really, really, really gold, but it shows up really pretty on your skin, even if you're um, fairly pale. So that's everything I got today. Thank you guys for watching. Um, make sure that you subscribe to this channel and hit the little bell to the right of the subscribe button so that you get notified every time I upload a video. Make sure that you check out the description box. Everything that I talked about today will be listed under there. Thanks again for watching. Make sure you give this video a thumbs up and I will see you guys in my next video.